This trailer is for a movie called Fractured, and the thumbnail caught my eye not only because it has Sam Worthington in it, and I like Sam Worthington. I know he's not in a whole bunch of stuff, and he's just generally not considered, you know, one of the top-rate type of actors, but I do like to watch a lot of the stuff he's in. Um, but the, the title also makes me think this is something that I might be interested in, and I'm seeing here now that it's a Netflix movie, so it will be readily available to me whenever I'm able to watch it. So let's go ahead and check this out. I love you, Daddy. Love you, sweetheart. You're a brave girl. So, what's the story, young lady? We're on our way to Minneapolis. Was it an accident? I fell. Daddy! Well, sooner or later, everybody does. Right, Dad? I nearly had you, didn't I? Since you're trapped, I'd like to do a CAT scan. Dad's gonna take care of us. I'm gonna wait right here for you when you get out. Okay. Keeping hours. You know how much longer it's gonna be? What was her name again? Perry Monroe. I'm not seeing a Perry Monroe. There hasn't been a scan since 9 o'clock this morning. So what are you telling me? They're not here. Got the whole day in front of me, I'm not finding any Monroe. I just want to see my wife and daughter. Do you have any footage? Don't record in treatment areas. I think the camera can't see them because of the chairs. You get a better angle. You saw my little girl. You treated her on. Oh, well, I've got to go and leave you word that they were here at all. I think I'm making them up. Why would I have my daughter scar? Another. There's something wrong with this place. I showed you the picture. That could be anybody. I'm as concerned about them as you are. Search the hospital! Nobody needs to get hurt. I mean, he's a head case. Put down all your guns! What have you done to my family? Quick, 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 quick. Okay, so as I'm watching this, I'm reminded of um, Brittany Murphy's last movie called Abandoned, <clears throat> which seems very similar. She goes, she takes her boyfriend to the hospital for an operation on his leg. He hurt his leg or something, and, and um, she's waiting for him and waiting for him, and, she, you know, she starts to, she goes to check to see what's up and they're saying oh, we don't have any record of him and she's just they it starts to um they start to you know believe maybe she's crazy or try to make her believe that she's crazy <clears throat> and she's trying to figure out what's going on and there's these different twists and turns so it kind of reminds me of you know when I was watching this I was thinking about that like I said so the premise is kind of similar only to a certain degree obviously this is going to take a different pathway to what the other movie did but this is certainly up my alley yes something i am very much intrigued to watch because i want to know the answer to these questions that they were posing to us in the trailer i uh, feel like the trailer was a, a skosh on the long side um maybe it Maybe there were some scenes that they could have cut out and didn't really need to be there. It wasn't obnoxiously long. It was under a minute and 59 seconds, but it did kind of feel like it was just going on a tad too long. But uh, that obviously does not diminish my interest in this. I will for sure be putting this on my to-watch list whenever it's released. Um, don't Did they say the release date? They just said October, I think, didn't they? Did they say October? Let me see if it says. It doesn't say here, but I thought I thought that they. Anyway, I think it's coming soon. In other words, within the next month or two. So, um, yep, I will return and make a comment about it once I get around to watching it. And I think that's it for now, you guys. Bye.